my tyres down, I was just using the Easy Air deflator, the AIB one. I reckon I've been using this for probably 15 years now since I've owned a four-wheel drive. It's lasted that long. They last for bloody ever, I reckon. Uh, they always let them down quick. You just got to make sure you screw it in because I have lost a pin in the sand before. Um, so I've done 30 on the front, 35 on the back, and then 25 on the caravan tyres. Um, What was that, Charlotte? What was that? <laughs> um, apparently the road's pretty bad, I've been told, so we'll just take it easy. No rush. Um, yeah, I was thinking about getting a pair of Storms or like, you know, something similar so I can just chuck on the tires and then they all go to 25, which I probably will eventually, but you know, it probably took me 15 minutes. So yeah, it's, uh, I heard it was bad. It's a, again, because we're going a bit slower than I normally would trying to hit corrugation. Oh. Uh, the shake test for the van, we'll see how she goes. Oh well, three Ks and then we're there. So, I lost my water cap and I've uh, been going back down the road and I think I bloody found it. You! Yeah. Uh, Alright. Beer time. Thought it was the first uh, loss on the van. Everything held out pretty well. A bit moved around obviously inside the van but Got the water cap. Got the water cap. Got the water cap, Charlotte. We found it. Yay! G'day, welcome back to an episode of AP Travels. If you're new here, I'm Adam. This is Charlotte. And then Jesse and Noah. We are now at Karajini Eco Resort. Go for a little walk around. You should be able to walk to Joffrey's from here, so we're gonna go check it out. Good jump. Oh, it's freezing, but we're here. Gotta do it. We've just made it to Joffrey's Falls. It is a grade five, so very impressive. Little Charlotte. Charlotte, no running. Oh. She made it, made it here on my shoulders. Jesse did a killer job. The water is freezing, but you almost forget about it once you're out. But how? Uh, check this out. <laughs> all right, Charlotte, we're all the way up here now. And you just, we only did a little drive yesterday. Okay, good morning. Um, Noah had a bit of a rough night. I think he's teething. Alright, we'll see you later on. Cheers. Alright, we're uh, now at Fortescue Falls. <laughs> Super busy. Car park is pretty much full. But, uh, alright. We'll see you at the bottom or on the way. Cheers. Fortescue Falls. I reckon Joffrey's was probably yesterday. That's not too bad. Let's go check out this waterfall.
Kirk Eco Resort now. Just a bit of a chilled afternoon. I'll put, I won't put that on. I won't only put the ones that I win. Oh. Getting there. Pardon? Pork's getting there. Ah, how good are afternoons in the Pilbara? Cheers from Karajini. Gorge. So there's three friendly or family friendly gorges that they say to check out. One is Hammersley, <clears throat> uh, this one Kalamina, and the other one is that we did yesterday, which was Fortescue Falls. The most track down to here is they say a class four, but it'll be alright, just it is a bit of a longer walk. 3Ks, I think. Was that one way? 3Ks. Okay, that's not too bad. Go up this way, please. No, the it goes down, doesn't it? All right, we've made it about. Well, we don't know, we didn't. This is what's not working. But we think we're a fair way through Palomando Gorge. You can keep going um, from the spot where we're at, but it looks like all just down um, the trees. I just have this book for the lunch. No people at all. If you want to trail, but um, compared to okay, Waterskew, which is, has like a normal road all the way there, it's packed. Go Cooey! Cooey! Yes, sir. Oh, come on. Cooey! Can you hear it, Eka? No, you try. Cooey! There you go. Here we are. Still at Kala Matra. Kalamunda. Kalamunda. Kalamina. Kalamina. Kalamina? Kalamina? I think it's it. Kalamina Falls. This is up the other way. Kalamina. Oh, I'll get the word right later. I'll show you. Kalamina. Look at this. Kalamina. Do you like it, Charlotte? You should see the uh, the trail that we had to get to get here, especially with Jesse and Noah. Good skills. Do you want to? Oh. oh no. How's that, Chief? Hold my hand. Go ahead, quick. Jump on the big one.
just finished at Palomina Gorge. I reckon that was uh, the best that I've seen so far. Um, just a pretty easy walk down, and then you, you know, walk along the flowing river, walk along the gorge. So many places to stop, and I know Shell loved it. Heaps, heaps of fish, that was pretty cool. And obviously, just towards the other end where the actual like, little waterfall is, there's like a little tree you can kind of get on. It was pretty hectic. Ooh, uh, yeah. But um, we made it. We did. We did. Oh, well, we saw a snake just out at our campsite this morning. I was having a look, I reckon it's just a python of some sort. <laughs> if you ever do come to Karajini, it is a pretty bumpy road if you're in a normal car. Alright, we're at Wayno Gorge now. Just uh, it's only 15 minutes up the road from the Karajini Eco Resort. Absolutely the worst road we've been on so far though. It is corrugated as hell. There's actually followed a tow truck in, so I don't know if they're actually picking up somebody. Um, here you have uh, Hancock, Kermit's Pool, um, but they're all like grade 5 and we really are not going to worry about it probably this trip. So we'll do the little few lookouts, hopefully look over Kermit's Pool and a few of the other places. Only a little 800 metres. And yeah, we'll find it. See what else we can find along the way. <coughs> so we just saw what the parks and wildlife look like. And he said, oh, it's worth a look. Only 20 minutes straight, pretty much straight down there. But oh, may as well. Welcome to day four, Karajini. We're back at Dale's Gorge. We were going to head out to Hammersley. We're going to head out to Hammersley, but it's like 85 k's and we we're getting a little bit low on fuel. You're actually surprising how quickly you go through fuel here. Daddy. Everyone is saying Fern Pool is the warmest pool, so we thought we'd come back down to Dale's Gorge and go check it out. We didn't really get time the other day when we went to Fortescue Falls because um, we had a swim and running out of time uh, so yeah we'll take care for our really last day at Karajini it's been an awesome few days one two three four five six seven eight good job That you can see it, but they're the um, the local bat to Karajini. I'll find out the actual name. I can't remember what it was in the tourist center. I was saying. What do you reckon? Nice. What do you reckon, Charlotte? I think that could be Lala and Mala and Kili and Bella and Molly and Kili. What do you reckon, Noah? Hey, you hear the birds? Yes. What do you hear? Do you hear the birdies? Here we are at Fern Pool and it is pretty bloody impressive. So I'm glad we've made the decision. I still reckon the water's freezing but I suppose we'll do it. 
Oh, good job, babe. She's in. Mummy's in for a swim. All right, hurry up, Chan. It's cold. In or not? Come on, jump. Go. Come in or not? Go. Jump. Yeah, this is good job. <laughs> here in Dales and then I would go a couple of nights at Ico because like we've done two days now of like driving all the way which is not an hour from the Ico resort to then um, to Dales Gorge which really like you could do a couple at Dales do uh, do Fortescue Falls um, and the ones around here Joffrey's which was that was our first day and actually that was a pretty nice waterfall that's, that's, it that's, was really nice that's probably comparison Joffrey's that was actually really nice. There's obviously a few others like Hancock that we didn't get to. Um, yeah. But we went to Wayno yesterday afternoon as well, and that was pretty nice. Um, Tempe Bowie, lunch. Tempe, which, all right, we're going to hit the corrugations. Are you ready? 